What are you getting out of your current marketing dollars? Are you able to tie your investment in certain channels and assets to sales? Often, for B2B and service companies, the ROI of marketing assets such as ads, video, and other content pieces can be hard to track unless you have closed-loop analytics. So, what is closed-loop analytics? Well, chances are your business has at least two data sources. Website data, such as Google Analytics, and sales data, which can live in an electronic customer database. Closed-loop analytics, quite simply, is tying those two sources of data together to get a holistic view of the customer's journey, from initial contact with your brand to sales. Let's start by looking at each data source separately. We'll start with Google Analytics. With Google Analytics, you can track the online behavior of those interacting with your marketing assets. For example, you add tracking code to your website and to your ad. A customer sees your ad and clicks on it. The customer browses your website and likes what she sees, so she fills out a contact form and clicks Submit. Traditionally, in Google Analytics, we can see data such as the ad that the customer clicked on to get to your site, what pages the customer viewed on your site, that the customer submitted a contact form. Unfortunately, that's typically where the marketing team's visibility ends. There's no way of knowing which assets on the website are associated with downstream sales. And though this is often the end of the marketing process, it's just the beginning of the sales process. Once that prospective customer submits a contact form on your website, her information is often automatically entered in the customer database. A salesperson then calls the prospect and will change her status in the customer database as she moves through the sales process. At the end of the process, the customer decides to purchase your product or service and the salesperson records the purchase amount in the customer database. So, your customer database may have which web form the customer filled out, detailed notes from the salesperson, status updates showing the days from initial contact to purchase, what the customer ultimately purchased, how much the customer paid. Here's the problem for your sales team. Once the leads originally arrive in the customer database, they all look the same. There's no visibility upstream into the prospect's previous website engagement. Closed-loop analytics ties the visitor behavior from Google Analytics with the lead and sales information in your customer database. Now here's an example of how we do it. When a customer first lands on your website, Google Analytics sets a cookie on their browser containing a unique ID. When the customer submits a contact form, it triggers the creation of a lead record with the unique ID in your customer database. Then, with closed-loop analytics, at every step in the sales process, an event is triggered, sending update data back to Google Analytics. Now we can see what channels, website content, and other marketing efforts are associated with quality leads and even sales. By viewing the customer's journey in its entirety from brand impression to sale, you'll be able to finally answer the question, how much revenue did that ad, video, content piece, or campaign bring in? Now imagine the possibilities closed-loop analytics can have for your business.